Netherlands won their first match and will try to do the same today to achieve early qualification to the second round. Hi friends, I'm JCA and this is the 2017 JCA World Cup Germany. You are watching JCA TV, a virtual world for real. Please support this series with a like. And if you enjoy this channel, subscribe and share. Let's get started. United Arab Emirates surprised in its first match with a draw. Will they complicate their opponent's life and give us a new surprise? Robben and company must give everything if they want to secure their place in the next round. In the real world, we will say that its victory could be taken for granted. But we are in the JCA universe. Everything is possible. We are ready, so let's start the match. Don't forget to thumb up. Meanwhile, I leave you in the company of Peter Drury and Jim Beglin. So a warm welcome to you all, we will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. My name is Peter Drury and here's my co-commentator for the game, it's Jim Beglin. Thanks Peter, it's a pleasure and a privilege for me to be here. Two starting lineups. The player to follow from United Arab Emirates is Khalil. Here's the player to follow from Netherlands, Droven. We're on the way. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Are you Robin? Even though, as a defender, you know what's coming, it's still very hard to stifle this fella's threat. 
a live wire who's always angling to get it on his left foot and, and what a left foot we're talking about. I think the opposition defence agreed too. He's going to be the source of so many of their headaches. Well, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. And it's Van Ginkel. Joel Veltman does well there. Alert. Schneider. Memphis Depay tries a through ball. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Good defending. He knew he had to stop it right there. Fair to say, I think a cautious start from both teams. He's cut it out. Robin. Managed to get it away. It's come loose. Tries lifting it over. Nicely worked. Goes for goal! Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Van Ginkel pumps it forwards. Oh, great ball! A loose ball it'll be a throw in and he's there to hoof it away Rishedli Bazour tries the route one option spreads it wide and the ball is out of play still and little doubt about which manager will be the happier right now so what now out to the flank he's come through and he's had a quick look inside forward aimed long and direct now the pass played out to the right that intervention was very necessary oh good interception And it's Robin. Looks like a good ball through. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Van Ginkel battles to win it back. Robin. Looks to slip it through. Boots it upfield. easy to guess who will be the happier manager right now absolutely Peter and I think due to the strength of the opposition they had to work on a defensive game plan and and then do the difficult part in executing it and so far they've been exemplary Brichetli Bazor 
Willems. Rashedli Bazor. Van Ginkel. Rashedli Bazor. And it's Huntelaar. Referee's given a throw. out of harm's way the referee's awarded a free kick Van Ginkel gets it away and it's half time here what do you think we're up to after 45 minutes? I think it's been a very impressive defensive effort. They've never been broken down and contained the opposition attack extremely well. Had a grossing half, but we're still where we started. Nil-nil. Here we go again then. The United Arab Emirates clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. Tries a long pass towards the front. Van der Veel. Tries to get it forward quickly. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Wasn't easy. Oh, he made that look really easy, Peter, but I can assure you that wasn't a, a routine save. He had to be very switched on there. been taken short whipped in defense has got rid of that Rashedli Bazor gets it back Joel Veltman Memphis Depay with the ball through Rashedli Bazor looking to get on the end of this and he's there to cut it out Still waiting for a goal to report here. Can he finish? It's in! What about that, Jim Beglin? Yeah, and teamwork was key to that. A beautiful piece of uh, engineering to, to set him free in the box. So the deadlock broken by the underdogs. Deftly done. That's a throw. And out to safety. Schneider. Jan Huntelaar passes it through. Yes, it's there! Unbelievable. Now oh, listen, the writing was on the wall. It looked like this was going to happen and it has. That's wonderfully done. Crisp hit, true finish. Look, volleys can be worked on and improvements can be made, but in the moment, it takes timing and balance to catch the perfect spot on the ball. 
to produce brilliance like that. That is absolutely magnificent. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal and just got caught napping. Intercepts the throw. That's well read. Away from immediate danger. Trying to get there. Robin. And it's Van Ginkel. Tries a through ball. Hutzela has a goal! And the defence can get it clear. Bazor. Looks like a good ball through. Goal! The Netherlands! Unbelievable. And the game is well and truly turned on its head. Oh, a goal of real quality. He made it look ridiculously easy. It's almost a case of, of sacrificing some of the power in favour of getting the technique right. And technically, that volley was as good as it comes. That's not an easy skill, we know that by now. That's fantastic. on the touchline seems there's going to be a change the Netherlands get themselves into the lead and they deserve great credit for turning things around but they'll now need the defense Bruma with the challenge and he has given away a free kick Willems gets it away. Now the pass. Schneider. And it's Robin. Looks to slip it through. Good strong hand by the keeper. Really well taken goal. Two to the good. They have breathing space. He was really quick to react to the initial save and he has his reward. Well, they say all goalkeepers are crazy and after that, maybe there's some truth in it. change here so I'm ready to come on the Netherlands are two up and into a position of real strength well that goal should be a big game changer it's certainly been a big mood changer Van Ginkel has given away a free kick good challenge he just stood firm out wide to the right Robin Puntala. He's missed, but not by that far. Well, when he struck that, he must have thought it was going in. Such are the margins of success and failure in this game. That was so close. He put on quite a show there. Well, in all honesty, he's tormented that defence. They just can't handle him. On the right now, what's on? 
Well, this man's contribution is, as you would expect, proving terrific. Well, having that sort of player in your side is reassuring because the rest of the team knows he can make his influence count at any stage. It's simply part of his package. When he really wants to, this fella scores. Robin, can he get through? Who's going to make this theirs? Tries a through ball. Rapidly approaching the end. The Netherlands have their place in the knockout stage all but secure. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Van Ginkel. Now the pass. How about it? Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Made it short. Can he score? Straight at the keeper. Yeah, I'm sure he was trying to place it in the corner of the net, but he's not likely to score by firing straight at the keeper. Pushes it out wide. And he's made certain that won't get through. Keeper's got good distance on that. Done very well to intervene. This official showing that there will be three minutes of added time. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. There is the final whistle. Quite a game. Memorable for its fluctuation in fortunes and astonishing turnaround. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? The United Arab Emirates have to question their whole attitude taken into this game for me. I think the performance was lacklustre from the first whistle and I think the atmosphere suffered on it too and I think for them this was one to forget. United Arab Emirates seemed to continue in the line of Black Horse and, in the way that started and scored, we saw a bright future for them and black for Netherlands that was off. The encounter continued somewhat stuck until, suddenly, Netherlands woke up of its lethargy of the hand of Robben and the celebration was painted of orange. Masterful passes goals and celebrations outside series. With Robin inspired in his last World Cup in the JCA universe, the Dutch qualified for the next round. United Arab Emirates continued fighting as much as possible. However, it was not enough and they returned with a defeat that did not taste so bitter. 
The next match will be Mexico against South Africa for Group D. That's all, friends. This is 2017 Chase EA World Cup Germany. I'm Chase EA, and you're watching Chase EA TV, a virtual world for real. Don't forget to support the channel. Please give a like, subscribe, comment, and share. See you soon. It's another year